a very warm welcome to all the NEED PG 2023 aspirants. Uh, we are coming up with a short video. We won't take too much time off uh, yours as we know we hardly have 54, 55 days for the examination. So quickly giving you an update regarding uh, the NEED PG application form start date. It is uh, today, that is 7th of January 2023. From 3 p.m., it, uh, the registrations have begun to apply for EPG 2023 exam. And uh, the registrations uh, would end on 27th of January 2023, 11.55 p.m. So it is approximately 21 days. We have time to register ourselves for EPG 2023 exam. Uh, the edit the editation option would be available from 30th of january to 3rd of february uh, but kindly note that you cannot edit your name your email address your test center as well as your mobile number and nationality these cannot be edited once submitted now coming on to 14th of february to 17th of february uh, the candidates who haven't posted their photograph correctly without a white background or the photo is not clear or the signatures are not uh, as per uh, information bulletin so or the thumb impression uh, is not clear or not in a proper rectangular box as shown in information brochure you may take a reference from the information or brochure which is official uh, which is now available on uh, nb website official website so editation of the of these three things photograph signature and thumb impressions uh, would be uh, starting from 14th of february and time to edit the details uh, time to edit the recti uh, time to rectify the uh, uh, mistakes would be till 17th of february uh, the admit cards uh, would be probably uh, issued on 27th of February and as we all know the uh, date for the examination is 5th of March 2023 so this is uh, about all about the information uh, all, all information about the important dates okay and uh, now coming out uh, on the fees uh, for the examination for general category students obc and ews students the fees for the exam would be 4250 and uh, for sc st and person with disability the fees would be uh, 3250 and uh, this can be paid by debit cards credit cards as well as using the internet banking so the eligibility to appear for NEED PG 2023 has remained same. Uh, you need to be an MBBS pass out student having a, a permanent or a temporary state medical council registrations. And uh, uh, now uh, coming on to the internship thing, uh, the uh, candidates uh, who are completing their uh, internship on or before 31st of March 2023 are eligible to write NEET PG 23 examinations and make sure that uh, uh, the internships dates uh, the, the, the certificate stating that you have completed your um, internship uh, the completion date should be uh, prior 31st of March 2023 or 31st of March 2023 and candidates would require to submit uh, these internship completion certificate at the time of admission or maybe even at the time of counseling to respective states. So moving ahead, uh, the evaluation pattern has remained the same. Uh, for the correct responses, it is four marks. For the incorrect response, one mark is uh, deducted and for no response that is unattempted question uh, uh, it remains zero for unattempted question uh, there is no deduction of marks so coming on to uh, uh, the identity cards at the time of registration or on the day of examination what you would require uh, it may be either of the one uh, it may be pan card driving license uh, voter ID, passport or Aadhaar card. Uh, 
so this would be the documents required at the time of registration or on the day of examination make sure these are valid uh, especially in case of passport and driving license make sure um, while you are appearing the exam and if you are carrying a driving license or a passport it is valid uh, on 5th of march we have seen in the past that a candidate who appeared who went to appear for the exam but his passport was invalid that the passport had expired it generally doesn't happen but make sure you cross verify the thing it is for your own good uh, now schedule of the examination uh, on uh, that particular day that is 5th of march uh, try to be there by 7 am or 7 15 by latest uh, Uh, entry closes at 8:30 a.m. and your formalities uh, begins uh, in the hall. That is your biometrics and each and everything begins at 8:30. Uh, they grant you access uh, with your respective credentials, and the exam starts at 9 a.m. and it ends at 12:30 p.m. So again, it's a three and a half hour exam only. Uh, evaluation we have already gone through so this is a summary step wise uh, first you need to fill an online application form and submit it you can also appear for a demo test at nbms website and uh, issuance of admit card as we know it would be by 27th of february uh, reporting at the test center on 5th of march there will be a security check there will be also registration for uh, the test plus uh, face id and biometric and um, like uh, the biometric verification and then at the time of uh, at by 9 o'clock the examination begins so this is a, a small summary they have given uh, now uh, there are candidates who are already pursuing uh, 2000 22 pg or maybe even 2021 they are already pursuing so nbs clearly mentioned that uh, the candidates who are already pursuing a pg course either through all india quota or state quota and are applying for the seat and all india quota state quota seats may confirm the eligibility condition of that university in this regards <laughs> the uh, ministry of health and family welfare or uh, dghs uh, like mcc of dghs uh, shall not be responsible for Uh, such candidates like uh, fine you are uh, ready to write neat pg you are eligible to write neat pg you you get qualified in neat pg 23 but uh, uh, the targeted place or the candidate where you uh, where these candidates have allotted been allotted a seat would be allotted a seat in 23 uh, they should check with those respective universities or states uh, whether they would uh, accommodate them would whether they would give the admissions so uh, you can write neat pg 23 that is not an issue yeah uh, as we know there's a special stray vacancy round uh, 2022 going on uh, which has just begun yesterday the registrations for the uh, not the registration the security money option has been opened uh, since yesterday that is from 6th of january to 8th of january so there is uh, the candidate suppose who got a lot a lot a seat in that particular round and he does not report he he won't be eligible to write this exam need pg 23 but uh, definitely uh, the candidates who are already pursuing a course uh, may take a note of this thing and uh, now coming on to uh, nri pa reservation Uh, the nri candidates would be eligible to apply for both the seats one is indian national seats which seats which are for indian nationals as well as nri quota seats uh, whereas in case of oci and pio uh, they will be only eligible for nri seats they won't be eligible for paid management seats or indian national seats so this is as good as last year uh, since 2022 Uh, they have started this thing that OCI and PIO will be only eligible for NRI seats, not for Indian national seats. And uh, NRI candidates will be eligible for both NRI seats and Indian national seats as we know. 
uh, for the candidates claiming to be an NRI or CIPO will not be eligible for reservations. They won't be eligible for uh, reservation, uh, any any kind of rebate in the fees and all these things. They won't. They cannot claim uh, NRIs, OCI, and PIOs. Okay. So uh, this is all about uh, the examination part. Uh, uh, I hope uh, I am. I was quick enough. I did not take too much time of yours. Uh, we really value your time. Uh, Last one thing I would like to uh, communicate to every doctor uh, that uh, I read it somewhere yesterday and uh, that uh, the focus should not be on the goal, the focus should be on the process. The uh, Ultimately the results come. I have heard uh, the same thing from MS Dhoni also. Uh, uh, being a cricket fan, uh, I have heard same from Virat Kohli also and yesterday also uh, somewhere fortunately I came uh, across uh, something related to uh, new year resolutions goals and uh, all these things we were discussing so uh, I genuinely suggest every candidate uh, you know better uh, uh, what are your goals but uh, uh, focusing on the goals is is uh, not a suggestion from our side the focusing on process that is preparation uh, 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 would be uh, better ultimately you will get your goal so focus more on your uh, preparations uh, we wish you a best of 2023 NEPG uh, we hope all the uh, doctors come out with a very good uh, anticipated or expected results and uh, one last thing, you all are doctors, you already have uh, studied this uh, five and a half years, including your internship. So you already have it inside you. Uh, it's, it's just recalling uh, and following the process uh, and focusing on the process uh, would ultimately get you your goal. So I wish everyone a very happy uh, not a new year but need pg 2023 experience god bless you all thank you and if you like this video you may always uh, we'll be very glad if you subscribe for our video or you follow us on youtube would be very glad thank you god bless you all thank you